Run, little Lystro, run! If he does a meteor, we're... Oh! Yeah. Toast. Oh, my goodness. What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome! Welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Ascended. That's right, we're playing here on the Omega server, having so much fun doing flips! My goodness, how's everybody doing today? I hope you're doing well, because me... I'm doing a little better than yesterday. Yeah, we ended off like it's been so far this season. Being taken out by one of those dang dirty dragons again. Or infernal wyverns. So hopefully we can actually make an entire day without that happening. I don't know. We'll find out. But on the progress side of things, things are going good. We set up last episode a crop plot to make ourselves yes some long grass and i'd say it's been going pretty well i have got quite a bit of long grass and it is more than enough to craft up kibbles yes and that would be for the alpha tier which i already did because you know it takes time um i've got two alpha natures two alpha mythicals and one alpha elemental so hopefully we can get one of our first alphas today we of course still have all the other kibbles for basic and or um for beta and then even more for basic so let's do what we can moving up in the tiers should be pretty cool today every day we got a new mount because our main mount yeah it gets taken out it's so frustrating but you know we make do with uh what we got we're gonna be rocking a basic earth pteranodon is a male so it doesn't really matter that much for the kibble farm today but i found something that might be kind of cool just chilling on our island dude look at this that's got to be a dimensional hold on Ultimate dimensional Bronto. Basically, anything that's dimensional, it can fly. Yeah. So when Brontos fly, uh, that's happening today. It's quite crazy. All right. But anyway, all things aside, check this out. It's nothing too fancy, but it will move us up to the cosmic tier up to being able to make alpha kibble if we can get this. So... I think I'd like to kick things off doing that. Of course, it is a meteor, so I've not seen a meteor uh, creature yet, and this things might not go too well. We'll we'll just find out. Cosmic tears are pretty scary, but anyway, guys. Yes, before uh, I put myself out there, just please remember to show it that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, seriously, what are you waiting for? It is the perfect time to subscribe also remember we do have a sub server so head on over to the discord if you're interested you will find the link down below in the video description all right let's get going with this all right so far so good so far so good it hasn't done its meteor oh we might get away like bandits dude it didn't do it once. Oh, this is so perfect. All right. So that would be a... Oh. Uh-oh. Okay. I might have... Uh, I might have went ahead of myself. Do we not have Gibble? We have normal Cosmic Gibble. But we... Ne oh, no! All right. We got to hope this guy uh, stays alive. We got to quickly find... That's... That's a... Ba we got to find a female normal Cosmic and get eggs. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I did this. What the crap, dude? You know, I think the same thing's going on with you that's going on with my uh my chieftain hat. That's supposed to be all clear. All right. So, let me go on the hunt. I really really want this. And who knows, we might find some other cool stuff along the way. All right. Wish me luck while I go searching. 
All right, we're back, and I went out for a bit and got myself a female banshee, which is the nightmare. We finally got a female cosmic, a singularity dodo. We got a beta tracker, so it's utility, and then a stone dodo. So let's go ahead. They're just the easiest to take out. Let's start to integrate them. Bada boom, 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 boom. And hopefully that worked. They are all gone. Awesome. All right. So that's going to bring our cosmic up to beta now. So we're going to hang out and wait for the egg. Um, We can get resource now. Awesome. Up to beta. So let's go ahead and make our new kibbles. And then we can see about our other cosmic guy knocked out over there. All right, our first cosmic egg, finally. So we can make a beta cosmic kibble. Beautiful. And then we have utility egg so that we can make an alpha um, utility. There we go. Nice. We're going to have to keep our eyes open for a taming. If that's possible. And then I also was able to make an alpha ethereal. So we're doing pretty good here. Um, All right. Let's go check out what's going on. Let's see. It's been a while. So I have a feeling. Beta ice parasaur. Oh, I took that guy out too. We got to wait for... A beta egg. All right, what do we got? Dimensional. I thought I saw something. Supernova. All right, that is a... Not the one. All right, where are you, bro? Let's see. Parasaur. I wish the spyglass was a little bit quicker to update. All right, let me see if I can find this guy. All right, I think this one will do. It is a female beta comet. All right, let's hope the comet don't hit us. Let's, where's the pickup? Let's pick this guy up on our shoulder. Let's hope that comet doesn't get us. All right, but um, parasaurs, we can bola. On a boom. Awesome. And let's get him out. I would assume we'll hear something if he's going to do a comet. All right. And out. Beautiful. All right. Let's go ahead and toss in the beta kibble. Hopefully one is enough. It might not be, but it is. I did come across a guy that took more than one kibble already. But, all right, golden. Let's get it inserted into the machine. Oh, he's on my shoulder. And that means we can go up to, assuming we get the egg, up to Alpha Cosmic as well. I think we'll probably be chilling at the Alpha tier for a little while because, um, yeah, it, it should be able to give us enough strength to go around and do whatever we want to do. All right, choose to integrate and integrate. Awesome. All right, and we got another. Let's go ahead and make another kibble in case we come across a another beta. And there it is. Awesome. All right. We can make another alpha and ethereal. And of course, most importantly, the alpha cosmic. All right. Let's do it. Bada boom. Beautiful. All right. Um, on our way, guys. On our way. Oh, baby. All right. I just found what we're getting. Come here, bro. We got to be... Oh, crap. We got to be quick with this. Come on, come on. Yes! 
All right, it is an alpha earth pteranodon. Absolute must. Come on, baby. Yes. All right, we only have one alpha kibble for the elemental, so we have to hope that works. There's a lot of shenanigans going on around here. There's carnos and terror birds right around the corner. Come on, baby. Oh, I thought it was higher than 220. But still, it's an alpha. Let's go, bro. And it is a male one, so we're not going to be able to insert it into the machine. I should have been more careful about that. But still, we absolutely want this guy. 1.7k health versus... 16. Okay, that's after the tame. Come on, buddy. Awesome. All right. We might actually start to get some good damage. That is super sick. All right. Can we... Can I get on you, please? Thank you, sir. All right. Let's keep on hunting. Ooh, guys. This is definitely not what I had it... Oh, no. What I had in mind for my first Alpha Cosmic, but it's a female... And it's something we can actually KO. The only problem is we got a wood alpha carno right here, which I just, I can't do nothing about him. Um, if I knock this guy out in the water, there is mantas that could get him. Um, there's a spiritual raptor around here too. I don't know. There's a lot that kind of stinks. Yeah, controller raptor. Oh my goodness. That's a raptor with like a UD roar. Oh, how are we going to do this, guys? All right. Um, I think I'm just going to... Uh, where is he? I don't know. I'm going to wait to see what happens. Either this guy flies away or the Cardo and raptors leave. We'll see what happens first. All right, all right. He's on the ground. Hopefully bullied. All right, bro. This is going to take a lot. Oh, oh, oh. We got to hurry. There is an alpha raptor here. There is an alpha wood carno in the area. There's theories all over. Come on, dude. Come on. Yeah. Yes. All right. Let's go ahead. Oh, no, 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 no. All right. Hopefully one is enough. It's a 360. So middle of the line. Come on, buddy. Oh, this is going to be amazing. And this also will allow us to land in the water, which is kind of cool. And we got it. Beautiful. All right. We need a saddle to ride it. So let's get back to the base and do that. I'm a happy camper. And we can leave this guy parked nearby the uh, kibble machine. And uh, hopefully we won't have to eat him just yet. But I don't know. I'm kind of interested. What is an alpha Pelagornis going to be like? Ooh, that took me a hot second. I didn't have enough to make the saddle, so I had to grind it out, but our Alpha Earth Pteranodon not doing so hot. So I think it is perfect timing. And check this guy out. 10,000 health on that guy. They're both alphas, but this has 18,000 on a Pelagornis. And that likely has to do with the fact that it's a cosmic so it's got a higher multiplier so let's let's still we still got to be careful let's choose wisely but come here buddy yeah that's not bad that is not bad all right let's do i guess we can always fly away let's do our meteor attack and I hit nothing. Okay, it goes... Oh, no, I hit that guy. That's hilarious. Oh, that is awesome. Ooh, that's scary. Omega Supernova right there. Holy crap. 
All right, I'm digging it. And we can now land on the water. If only you could shoot off of this guy. It would be so sick. But we should be able to regen stamina this way. So that's cool. We can use this for surveilling stuff. If only the spyglass would update. All right, this is cool. So um, what are we up to now? We are up to alpha in utility, in nature, in mythical, in ethereal, in cosmic, and uh, we're back up to it now. I'm actually producing it in elemental, so that's cool. Um, for betas, we need unstable. There is a alpha meltdown pteranodon right by our base, so that would actually be pretty helpful. Um, rage, resource, summoner. So all these are things that we want to go after. Ooh, ultimate meltdown. All right, so let's continue to hunt. You know, it's kind of the name of the game. What else we got? What else we got? The colors are really throwing me off. I, I do have to say. See, there's the alpha meltdown. There might even be two of them. So anyway, let's see what we can find, guys. We got to go after the small stuff. It really makes it hard because we are just using vanilla tranks. I may have to upgrade to a tranking mod because it, it just might be too difficult for us. Um, in the normal Omega, there is, you know, tranks for each level. So it gets a little rough. And then potions are a little rough as well. Um, and the potion mod that I have is... It's uh, it's pretty expensive. It's definitely a pretty expensive proposition. So, you know, we'll do what we can. But anyway, this is definitely an upgrade. Ooh, guys, I found another alpha cosmic. It's also a meteor type, just like us. Um, I think we should get this guy absolutely um let's pack up the pelagornis i don't want anything goofy happening let's set down a teleporter because things can go really wrong really quick oh my goodness can you set down the stupid thing oh it's so annoying um there we go if you have something in your hand it won't let you set it down all right that's our guy, I believe. What I would give to have the uh, the net gun in this. Holy crap. Dude. This is going to be a little crazy. This is just a Lystro, but it's a 540 Lystro. It actually could probably be a decent mount, too. All right, almost halfway up. Come on, buddy. Hopefully he doesn't do the meteor. If he does a meteor, we're... Oh! Yeah, toast. Oh, my goodness. That's okay. This is why I put down the teleporter. This is why I put down the teleporter. Um, I also noticed something weird. Okay, it didn't happen this time. Another time, I couldn't find my body, and it ended up being at the bed over here. It was so weird. I don't even know what to make of it, but anyway. Let's get back to our teleporter. Bada boom. And, oh, it actually didn't switch swap our bows. So it would be right there. All right, let's get this guy bullied again. This one, yep. Oh, come on. All right, let's go. I wonder if it's getting a mate boost from the other Lystro right there. Let's give a little bit more space. 
Come on, come on. But I mean, if we have this much trouble just getting out a Lystro, like, imagine when it comes to something else. Is that enough? I think it went down. All right, beautiful. And we have to hope that this is enough. Okay, it was. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. All right, come here, buddy. Let's pet him. And let's ride him. What do we got here? A metal Lystro 540. All right, anyway. Anyway, anyway. Let's just see what this guy does with his meteor. Oh, dude, that is not bad. We just got to keep in mind we don't have a saddle. Holy crap. Run, little Lystro, run! All right, uh, that we might we might have made mistakes. We might have made mistakes. Go, 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 go! Crap! It dismounted! No! Oh, crap. Crap, crap, crap. Did I pick him up? Wait. I picked him up, I think. I think I did. I don't I don't see him. I don't see him. Right? Yeah, I don't see him. I think we got him. Oh. I could have been bad. I didn't really think that through. But anyway, pretty cool. Let's pick up our teleporter and let's get back to the base. Whew. Thank goodness that was important. Why was that important? Well, so that we could be a little bit more reckless. Um, choose females to integrate because we have the Pelagornis female, but I didn't want to be reckless with it. Bada boom, but now we can, because if we lose it, we're not going to lose anything from the, uh, you know, progress of the kibble farm. So that will get us up to prime media, uh, prime cosmic now, which is absolutely sick. But let's see, let's see. This thing is absolutely game changing for us because I can actually go against like pretty reliably, you know, any most anything that's alpha and below. Ideally basics and betas. But this guy is just amazing. Look at how much he's hitting for. Let's see. Ready? Oh, that guy's got to be mate boosted or something. I was hitting for over a thousand on other guys. Oh, and then fish. What is that? An alpha brutal? Do I hit sharks? No, I don't hit sharks for more. I hit fish for more. Come on, buddy. Let's get the crap out of here. Dude, look at all the megalodons coming after me. What the crap? All right, what do we got? What do we got? All right, let's see what we hit this guy for. There we go. Much better. 1,300. That is more than I spin on the Pteranodon, which is phenomenal. And then... Look at that. It does so much. It hits multiple times, and then it sets them on fire. Such a good ability, you can see. It takes a long time to uh, get it all back. But yeah, so far, believe it or not, is our very best creature. Which is kind of hilarious, but... Not complaining. Ooh! Come here, buddy. Nice! Alright, let's get you scooped. Very cool. So, I don't know. I'm pretty happy. We can actually move on. Uh, I'm pretty sure we can actually make the kibbles for Prime. It's not until it gets to Ultimate where it gets way pricier. So, that's cool. The only problem is how are we going to knock stuff out? So, there is a tier of creature that will allow us... Come here. Dude, we one-shot him! That is so good. Um, there is a type of creature that is taming and does torpor, and we are up to alpha in the kibble for it. They're just unusually rare, and the only ones that I've found for it has been really, really tiny stuff. You know, things that just wouldn't be helpful. 
So hopefully we can come across something good. But I think now that we have this guy, we can probably come next time, start to journey a little bit deeper into the island. Um, we probably got to work on our movement speed, get our saddle upgraded. Oh, 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 what the crap? No, 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 what is that? Fire wyvern. What do you think? We can't set him on fire. All right, come here, buddy. So here's the problem. I've noticed a lot of the creatures. Oh, I don't know what happened. Um, a lot of the creatures from the Draconic mod will actually be like, you know, variants of Omega, but it doesn't show up in the spyglass and tell me. The same thing with all of the Zytherian um, crit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All of his stuff also, I've noticed, does not seem to take the buff. And I've noticed this for, uh, like, shiny dinos as well, which is super bizarre. Um, if it ends up being that way, and I've been hoping it doesn't, we're going to end up removing the mods because they're just taking up spawn space. Because anything that can't get an Omega buff is just useless. You know, because they're not going to get more powerful as we move up. See, here's another one. Tech Baryonic is not buffed. So I don't know what's up. But yes, anyway, it would be cool if it would get updated and fixed. I don't know why it does that. Or is it just not showing? So I don't know. We'll find out, dude. Ultimate Singularity. <sighs> That is terrifying. I kind of want to wait until he does his attack so you guys can see it. That would be a heck of a creature. And that is actually the tier we should be able to get up to that come next episode. Or not ultimate. We'd be going up to prime. But still. Oh, there's a singularity right there. Holy crap. It is so cool. It just, oh man, what did that? Was it one of these tiny guys? I don't know. I don't want to get sucked up in a singularity. So what you going to do? But anyway, we are starting to make progress. Um, You know, it's been a little slow. What we've been doing has been going a little slow. But you got to know how absolutely terrifying it is out here. Like, you know, you've seen the few times that I have traveled out every single time we lost our mount. It is so unbelievably scary. But yeah, what you going to do? Um, Tranks, I may end up adding a tranking mod because a lot of this other stuff, it's like so cool. I want it so badly. This should be a knockout tame now, and this would actually help us for the rejuvenating um, to heal everything back, but I don't know if I'd be able to get that guy knocked out, and that's a basic. I don't think I'd be able to knock it out. I can only really take on the smaller stuff at this point. So, is what it is. Spiritual sand dragon. Dude, that would be so cool. All right, this guy shouldn't attack back. I don't think I can bola him, though, but I just want to see. Yeah, I mean, he flies away. I... Oh, man. That would be so cool. I'm probably going to have to trap him. But as I said, that's a basic. Oh, my lord. So, you know, imagine as we get up to the higher tiers, I just don't know if it's possible unless we get a taming dino. So we shall see. But anyway, guys, I think we're going to call it here. It has been a long day for me. I've done a lot off camera, a lot of the kibble farm. And I have to say in between each clip is like an hour of searching and hunting for stuff. And it doesn't help the spyglass does not update immediately. 
But um, anyway, thank you all so very much for watching. It's been a pleasure, as you always do. Please remember to show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, please do not forget to subscribe for the daily arc awesomeness. See you tomorrow, guys. Thanks again, and peace out.